What's up guys, it's Kayvon from Functional Fitness VA and today we have a little lower body circuit for you. So, I pick my kettlebell up here off the ground with two feet, then I get set with one leg for some single leg deadlifts with a kettlebell pass. Let me show you from the front here, so you can see that at the bottom I pass the kettlebell over to the opposite hand, I alternate every rep. I stick with the same leg, in my case here my left leg, doing all the work. Now if the pass is too difficult, you can always hold it in one hand while you do your deadlifts, I'd prefer the opposite hand of the working leg. Or if you need to, you can throw two hands on it. Just keep it real close to the front of your leg here. But that's eight total reps. Now, next here, I'm going to pop it up, turn it upside down in my palm. My feet are squat width. I'm going to start passing it, doing the hot potato. And then I'm going to squat while doing that hot potato. We call it the mashed potato. So I keep the kettlebell going back and forth. Notice it's very small and very quick. As I squat up and down, I try not to let the kettlebell moving make my squat too weird or move me too much. So for that, I'm also going to do eight reps. There we go. Take it down safely. Now, since my left leg was my working leg and my single leg deadlift, that's going to be the working leg here in my windmill. That means it's my back leg. So my feet turn to the right. I keep that kettlebell close to the non-working leg here, my right leg. And I'm going to do low windmills. I rotate, so I like keeping my top hand up. You don't have to if you don't want to, but I find it helps you stay rotated correctly as you do this. Remember, back leg stays straight. I hinge into it, kind of diagonally, and I squeeze my glute to stand up. So it's a diagonal hinge here in the low windmill. That's eight reps also. Then, after my eighth rep, I set it down, I take a breath, breath and I switch legs. So it'll be right leg working for my single leg deadlift and my windmill, but the mashed potato squat stays the same. Do that three times through on each side, resting about a minute in between each one. 